Hello everyone, welcome to Back My Channel. 90 Day Fiance couple Jasmine Pineda and Gino Palazzolo are seemingly no longer together after filming season 10. Jasmine, 36, and Gino, 52, were introduced in 90 Day Fiance. Before the 90 Days season 5, their contrasting personalities made Jasmine and Gino an entertaining franchise couple, and their popularity has just kept on increasing in the past few years. Whenever it looked like Jasmine and Gino were done for good after a massive fight, they get back together to the shock of fans. Jasmine's behavior made her look like a gold digger wanting fame and control, while Gino was extremely easy to manipulate. Jasmine humiliated Gino by constantly comparing him to her ex-boyfriend Dane and even lied to him about a sex tape just to rile him up. Jasmine wasn't a fan of Gino's family since they suspected she was using Gino for a green card. Jasmine let Gino know that she wasn't interested in inviting them to their wedding. However, Jasmine turned over a new leaf in episode 13 when she told Gino she was trying to become a better person. Jasmine and Gino's relationship seemed to have gotten better after their recent Miami trip in season 10, but that doesn't mean they got a happily ever after in the end. Jasmine and Gino's relationship problems began even before they met in person. Jasmine used to ask for evidence and reports of Gino's whereabouts while they were dating long distance. Gino had been secretly in contact with his ex who was receiving nude photos of Jasmine. Jasmine discovering this led to their first split. Many other breakups followed for Jasmine. They almost broke up when Gino asked Jasmine to sign a prenup or when he refused to pay the rent for her expensive apartment in Panama. Jasmine's close relationship with her ex-boyfriend, Dane, was also an issue for Gino. The couple fought over finances and Gino, choosing his family over Jasmine. Jasmine was first spotted in America in June 2023. A Reddit user had posted Jasmine and Gino's photo taken from a distance to confirm the gossip. The fan mentioned Gino and Jasmine were walking together in Plymouth, Michigan. Jasmine wore a hat just like Gino in the pic. Jasmine was still in Panama in 90 Day Fiance. Before the 90 Days, the reveal had come as a major spoiler for those who were watching Jasmine and Gino fight on screen about her ex-boyfriend Dane's involvement in her life. The promos for B90 Season 6 had teased a major argument between the couple to suggest that they'd split. Fans will have to wait until the 90 Day Fiance Season 10 final to find out what the most awaited wedding day of the show looked like. However, seven months later, Jasmine is showing no signs of being in a happy marriage with Tino. The Michigan man wanted to get engaged to Jasmine the first time he met her in person. He was shown going to a jewelry shop to buy Jasmine a $270 ring from a local shop. Gino had his reasons for buying a cheap ring. He wanted to propose to Jasmine and had no time to waste before she could change her mind. Jasmine was moved by Gino's romantic gesture. The price tag didn't bother Jasmine. She declared that no diamond could equal Gino's love for her. However, Jasmine wanted a different ring in 90 Day Fiance. Before the 90 Day Season 6, Jasmine insisted he gets her a new ring while they were at a jewelry shop to buy a gift for Jasmine's younger sister Liz. Gino had walked out of the store feeling angry at Jasmine. He claimed she had misplaced her ring because she'd stopped wearing it. It was not a ring I would ever buy for me or for any other person, Jasmine had said. She'd started using the wedding ring she'd received from her ex-husband. Gino's ego may have been left damaged by what Jasmine said because he did give her a new ring. Gino presented Jasmine with a massive rock in episode 13 as they were celebrating the end of their Miami trip. Would you marry me? He asked her in Spanish, as Jasmine said yes to Gino. He said the ring he bought for her in Panama was not the most expensive ring, so he wanted to propose to her with an upgraded ring. I love it. Jasmine cried and told the cameras that she always wanted a different engagement ring. Jasmine's recent photos show that she's been spending a lot of time in New York. Jasmine recently flew to NYC on a business trip. Jasmine wrote that good things are on the making, 
and use the hashtags hashtag vegan protein and hashtag jazzy protein. Jasmine seems to be building her brand now that she has possibly secured a work permit after her wedding. Jasmine posted a video story to tell her fans that she had a photo shoot lined up for something she was working on. Jasmine, however, chose not to say anything until I have everything ready.